Yes. Uh, if you are still there. Um, so unlike the last game, this game is infinite. So we'll be playing uh, whatever this is forever. Um, oh, this is not a controller game. This is a mouse and keyboard, I believe. I believe. Uh, hello, if people are there. I think you are. I think we're back. But I guess we'll find out. Oh, this can be one of those things where I'm not allowed to know uh, the instructions to the game. I just have to intuit it. Oh. Because it's a game like an interview for a coding position. Real talk. If I had opened this game and see what you're seeing now, I would probably just wheel the chair away and back Remove orange oh, hexes. No, telling you. How to Remove play. orange hexes to reveal the pattern underneath. The number in an empty hex tells you how many adjacent hexes. Are... Oh, this is like that game. And the adjacent hex, the one my mom, uh, it starts with an M. I don't know, Mandala? Mandala? Mandala something? My mom Mangala. used to play it. No, not Mangala. That would be an upsetting game for my mother to play with me. <laughs> just thinking, hey, honey, today we're going to play Mangala. It's just to give things a start with You know M. how you play doctor with your friends? <laughs> well. <laughs> so it's all this overcooked orange Left padding. click to mark a hex as part of the pattern. Right click to destroy hexes that aren't part of the pattern. All right. Destroy hexes. Number of empty hex tells you how many adjacent hexes are part of the pattern. So are we in a maths test now? Have uh, we gone from this is an IQ a, test. Have we gone from working in a really bad kitchen to uh, a math test? What? So six to all of them are right because Remove it's six. orange hexes to reveal the pattern underneath. The number in an empty hex tells you how many adjacent hexes are part of the pattern. Left click to mark a <laughs> hex as part of the pattern. Right click to destroy hexes that aren't part of the pattern. Uh, Minesweeper. Oh, is that the one you meant? Minesweeper? No. Oh. No, it's literally an analog game. This is not a computer. Where, uh, game. yeah, there's oh. like a wooden tray with beads in it. Yes. Mastermind. Mastermind. Oh, Mastermind, yeah. And it had the cover with the um, yeah, yeah, yeah. gentleman from like a Bond film. And, yeah, like, his, all right. His, so two uh, of these. Is it the one with the cover and his, his uh, Asian companion? So how, how, do you, how do you remove an orange hex? Click on it, I presume. No, that just turns it blue. Yeah, remove. Yeah, remove them. Turns it blue to reveal the pattern underneath. Okay. <laughs> See, this makes me feel like I'm trying to get into like a MIB style government organization, and I'm just failing the initial test um, completely. Okay. I mean, I think I did it. But I'm not failing. You're failing. I so don't. It's okay. Oh, you did it. It says mistakes z six and remaining yes, zero. Yes, I just literally clicked everything. <laughs> I am not smart enough. What's the matter? Don't you like our smart people game? <laughs> <laughs> Don't you like to be smart for fun? Hey, Sokka says we'll never know about the aliens now. Okay, literally, how do I move on to the next thing? <laughs> uh, he says the three shows that all three touching it are patterned. <laughs> uh Selkos, aliens? I'm an artist. I don't aliens? have to do What are the aliens? Was math. the aliens in Overcooked? I mean, other than the meatball, the meatball zombie. The meatball golem. The meatball uh, Armageddon creature. Right, right, right. So, right, so this is zero. So neither of these can be part of the pattern. Yeah? Ah. Oh. You, is, so, right? Is realization dawning? Right. See? So uh, zero touching these, so this can't be either. But it means that that one has to be. Oh, no. Guess no, not. It's a zero, but the one where it says two. Because one, right. that must be blue, right? Yep, yes. must be. And that one, or the top one, must be blue. Well, so. So we're trying to one of these first two. Because that would make sense. No. no. So it must be that. Oh, okay, because that's... Right, because that's what's touching this one. All right, all right. I'm slowly work. understanding. This is like Minesweeper, but with very I'm, calming I've music. I've never played Minesweeper. This music says, hey, use essential oils. <laughs> Don't vaccinate your children. This is like... Homeopathy. But this, it does kind of look like a virus, really, that you're working with. It does. With, so... Uh, no, <laughs> no lie at all. Uh, I've never played Minesweeper. I thought it was like um, Battleship, except just sort of one person. Like you're sweeping for mines. I don't know. All right. So there's four pattern things remaining. So one of these <laughs> two touches it. Two of these. <coughs> so let's try that one. There we Speaking go. This is why I like Half-Life. 
and uh, hey, yeah, I guess maybe, right? I'm not, yeah, I'm not yeah. grooming you, Boom. I was just making it Boom. so the microphone was there. Uh, you got it? No. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! I thought I did, but no. Alright, so, there we go. How is this game on a 100 best games of all time list? Which um, is because when it. you're at work and you're trying to kill time, this is alright. One person battleship is the best way to describe Minesweeper. Ah, cool. I'm glad I accidentally described something well. I'm gonna reward myself with a sip from my. Okay, look, stun. look, I've, I've. Oh. All right. All right. Your, vi right. your virus is seventy-five percent cured. You may return to work in the kitchen as a line chef. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Uh. Sort of. Kind of. All right. So two. Right. Yep. Boom. Ah. Please note. Oh, well done. I'm a smart person, not please, really. Please note, this medical treatment costs 68,000 US dollars. This reminds me of the kind of thing that people who in the 80s said that they don't watch TV would play. The, they don't watch TV? Well, people don't oh, brag oh, about not watching TV anymore. Right, because they're busy just using... Using the internet uh, at all times. Because they're busy doing the New York Times crossword <laughs> yeah, and yeah. Uh, playing... Uh, I listen to jazz <clears throat> and drink uh, unfiltered water for fun. <laughs> I love unfiltered water. Hey, I'm eating a uh, plain oyster. All right, my snack of choice. Here we <clears throat> go. This is uh, I feel like the music should be like some R&B funky. I like, know. I, I want a little funky cold Medina here. Like uh, Tetris. You want some Russian Cossack pop? All right. So five of these bad boys. Raw water, indeed. Yes. Oh, see. That's somebody who reads my yeah. Twitter feed. That's an old one. <clears throat> I remember uh, the raw water. Hey, do you see that they're opening a hotel in space? It's only $9 million. To what stay for what 12 does days. space mean? It's a space Low station. Earth orbit? Yeah, space station. Cool. It's supposed to be up by 2021. Anyway, back to this scintillating uh, computer game here. If I've ever seen a spectator sport, it is this. Oh, I mean, I, this must be so fun to watch, you guys. I know that my heart's going a mile a minute. Uh... Also, there's no penalty for the mistakes you're making, so, like... It's, I don't know if it's because of Overcooked, but this just really makes me want honeycomb. I just, oh, I just want a delicious piece of violet crumble for the Australian viewers. Any of you 15 viewers Australian? Oh, 14 now. That one person realized that they were being called out for being Australian and left. Makes you want honeycomb. <laughs> do you have like, what's your chocolate honeycomb treat in America? We don't really do that. Why not? It's delicious. Mm. Uh, yeah, but there's only so much. Oh, thank you, Bluehead Beastie. It's fun to watch the snarky commentary. I feel like there's only so much snark we're going to be able to get out of this particular game. Uh, <laughs> I feel like because there's no penalty for the mistakes, mistake, I'm just like. Mistake 11. Oh. Well. <laughs> sure. Remaining okay. four, mistakes 11. Oh, so it doesn't, like, go game over at some point. No! You don't... There's ah. three remaining. Uh, yeah, Selkos, you got to pay, like, 800000 as as a non-refundable deposit. It's very specific that it's a non-refundable deposit. So when the whole business goes belly up in a year, they just get to keep yeah. everyone's $80,000. I imagine. Uh, so there's no... It's not like, oh, you click no, on No, but I'm getting many. it now. I'm getting it now, right? Yeah, but so, if you can't lose the game, right? Sure. So why don't you just click on every single thing? Well, the, I mean, wait, there's wait, wait. No, because there's no skill in that, Heath. Because there's no skill in just that. Just a minute. Let's just try this. I don't understand how this works at all. So let no, me no, can... don't lose it for me. <laughs> I feel but, but I won't be losing it. Like, if I just press I every single it. one. Look, Stop it! Look. No, no, oh. no, no! I was winning it! You ruined it! Did I win it? No, stop it! Oh. Stop! Look at the But if I do this, right? No, stop it! See? Now I win! Ah! See? No! So my point is. What did you? What did you do? It's still complete! Oh my god, I'm so glad we didn't go to school together! <laughs> So my point is, I just randomly clicked on a bunch of things the whole time, left click first, no. then right click, and I still won the level. Won the no, level. No, no, I won the level because I was figuring out the puzzle. But anyone could. All you have to do is left click no, or no, right no. click on no. every single you just, cell. You just indiscriminately entire... clicked. I solved the puzzle. 
You indiscriminately click. But if you solve the puzzle, you just end up with less mistakes, yes? Well, you were just And the mistakes clicking. have no consequences in terms of actual well, gameplay. Well, I mean, this has no consequences, full stop, because it's a stupid <laughs> game. But, uh... Uh, I hate to say it, I liked Cooking Apocalypse. For those better. of you who just tuned in, this is just us <laughs> arguing uh, about um, taking the mouse away. Uh, okay, will you do one? I, I don't really understand it yet, so do one more. Okay, please, I got so it. So I can um, try and understand what's going on. Ooh. Oh, gross. Now they've got inside brackets. So the now we're actually doing math. mean the surround... It, no, absolutely. It's like a X's calculator. are consecutive. What does that mean? Excuse me, I'm, uh... So they're touching? Uh... Numbers I get it. inside yep. brackets give you Got additional it. information that surrounding hexes are consecutive. Oh, so as in they're not... They have to be touching, is that right? They have to be adjacent? Yeah. So, okay, so this I figured that out, because it, only four of them were touching, so if one wasn't it, the others had to be contiguous. They mean contiguous, not consecutive. Like the contiguous American states that yes. they talk about all the time. In, indeed, that is what, that is what they mean. So contiguous, because consecutive would have to be a set, right? Like one, two, three. Mm -hmm. They don't even know what words mean. I find this all the time with knitting patterns. Just to nerd it up here, <laughs> uh, like they don't. Excel's not exciting <laughs> enough for you. Let's move on to knitting patterns. They don't, they don't understand what um, prepositions they they mean to have. They say. Like, hey, through, and they mean between. Puppy yeah. Alright. <laughs> Again, that just makes me want to eat honeycomb. Right, so it's, because this is zero, I know that none of these touching it can be blue. Uh, Part of the pattern is confusing as well. Just blue. You're looking for blue. Oh, oh, right. So blue is like honeycomb that had water poured on it. Yeah. I'm just not letting the honeycomb thing go. I just want a snack. I'll have an oyster cracker. These people are good with shapes, not words. Exactly. They don't really want words in here at all. I have a feeling like at one point, I felt like if you went into a coma and then <clears throat> you tried to use an iPhone in 10 years from now, this is probably what the UI will look like. They'll have replaced words entirely this is uh, a just, novel from tw 2211 just, <laughs> like, just oh, I really love the, the, the brackets really made an amazing denouement <laughs> oh I don't care <laughs> god hey, so viewers you guys know everything so you might know if and some of you stream which um, at least one of you does can you tell me if I can change games mid stream or do I have to end the stream as I did and then plunge back into a new stream please leave your suggestions <laughs> in the comment field hexagons are very futuristic that's true like in deus ex the whole menu um human revolution and mankind divided it's all very hex hexagonical uh it's because six is a very futuristic number that's what it is octagons oh yeah. we made nine mistakes octagons are old hat hexagons oh, are hexagons are hat. the future yeah Squares? Is this game trying to trick me to doing math? Yes, it absolutely is. This is like the story problems we used to have to do in school. So this time I didn't just indiscriminately click on a whole and bunch of things. And I had nine mistakes, not 23. It, okay, but that's all. Other than that, it still says complete. So what difference does it make? Uh, I feel I, like mine was, I feel like these games want to be like mine the... Mine was more of a Gordian knot solution. I feel like these games want to be like the game that Riker brings back from Ryza in The Next Generation. Oh, yeah. But it can't actually like uh, stimulate your dopamine receptors go, and, oh, and give you a yeah. little gross crusher orgasm. Yeah. yeah. I mean, uh, I feel like if I'm going to do something like this, I'd rather play Peggle. For sure. <laughs> no, this game sucks. Can we leave it without dumping everybody off the stream? No, I think if we leave it, we will be dumping everyone off. I'll look back at my streams, and there'll be like seven 11 minute streams. Uh, but by the same token, cool. this is also boring. So if that's the way it's got to be, you can gonna... change games midstream. Oh, Selkos, educate me. Teach me your ways. I don't understand. In the meantime, now. I'll do another one. Uh, okay. Well, let me, let me see if I can change games. Uh, cat, keep talking while I do this. I hope everyone enjoyed Math Corner. <laughs> Happy little hexagons, as Bob <laughs> Ross would say. If a train leaves Maine with six hexagons and another train leaves Seattle with eight hexagrams, how many octagons will be created by the collision in Nebraska? Vermilion. 
So I think I can switch games midstream. That's what I'm trying to do. So let's see how we go. This is all because uh, I was too good at Tetris 99 last night. Oh, it's all happening. Heath was delighted to see how much I would hate it. And instead, I just played it for hours. <laughs> But I couldn't get better than third place in Tetris 99. I think I did it. Ah. But the monitors are going crazy. Sorry, folks. They're Can going... we see Cat win Tetris? Cat the hasn't monitors won are yet. Very unhappy. Um, I've gotten up business. to third place, but I have not won yet. Unfortunately, it's really hard to stream on the Twitch or on the Switch. We screw that the up Twitch. all the time. <laughs> we do. On the, the, house, on we're the constantly, Switch. We're constantly saying like, "Oh, you got to get the Twitch." Uh, by the way, I don't know if the music's too loud, uh, or was before when it was just soothing music. Now we've got subterranean sound effects. So we're playing another game, Where's, Kat. My, where's our child? Where's your child? <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's called okay. Spelunky. I, I don't know anything about it. Thank you. Um, how do I say? Is it Habkudu? It, that's Hab the Klingon one. Oh, that's right. What I is it? Is Klingon for... Um, SJW, oh, I don't know. I forgot. Explaining me how to do it. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's you, obviously. That's actually, that's that's basically actually me. you, except with the green bow. All right, we left our math test behind, and now we're doing an Indiana Jones knockoff, as far as I can tell. That's much better, but it could also trick me into doing math. You don't know what these games are. I was it trying looks, to trick you into it something. It looks old schooly platformy to so me. So do most things. That's true. Days. Many things do. It looks like an Indiana Jones ripoff, is what it looks like. Do you not have anything else to do other than... You picked up a journal. <laughs> Greetings, my name is Yang, and this is my journal. Dusty maps and rumors of amazing treasures have led me here, deep under the desert. It is less hot here. There's something very strange about this place. The layout seems to change all the time. I've never seen the same room twice. Then again... <laughs> is there procedurally generated? <laughs> <laughs> It could be the legendary Curse of Olmec. Oh. Curse of Olmec! Oh, oh it's like... Was the, that the game where they no, around? Yeah, yeah, the, the legend of Cat the temple. Cat showed me that game. It was very strange. Uh, the, yeah. Uh, the one they say traps people inside the caves forever, or as long as they have to stream. Uh, or it could be procedurally generated, like you said earlier. I pushed the idea out of my mind and focused Legends on the Legend of the Hidden Temple, that's it. This just changed tenses. I push the idea out of my mind and focus and on the treasure instead. If a master, if I master the basics of movement and combat, I know I'll leave here a rich man. Oh look, he's got a whip. Definitely not an Indian. There's a very ripoff. angry snake. And there's a snake. Snake's like, Again. do you mind? I live here. On uh, uh, Lucasfilm, is it Lucasfilm? No, uh, Paramount. Uh, well, Lucasfilm. And uh, Paramount with the mountain. Nothing to see here. It's definitely nothing to do with Indiana Jones. <laughs> it's nice that the ancient. Aztecs have uh I thought you would chose to be the girl. I did. But you're this guy. Have left uh A buttons all over. Journal the... entry added. You should do the journal entry. Alright, what have we got? Not that. Right button. I was gonna play the game. N no. I mean, you will play the game, but we're going to look at what it added. It must have added a monster or something else. Oh, yeah. oh Snake. The bane of every adventurer. It enjoys hiding in pots. Ah, oh, Snake. <laughs> snake, Snake. Oh, it's not a pot. It's medicinal, it's a snake. okay? Anyone else remember that meme? I really hope the next monster is a badger, 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 badger. Mushroom, mushroom. Uh, Legends of the Hidden Temple. Yes. Uh, if you jump on a snake in real life... So is that... What's that? A plus right trigger? Yeah, I guess a running jump? Or oh, a yeah. Little better some jump? little thing. <clears throat> some little thing. Climbing ladders. Badger, badger, badger. Mushroom. I remember the first time someone showed me that, they neglected to mention the fact that it just ran in an infinite loop, as Flash did back in the day. They just let me watching it for far too long. And in the ground. 
Did you just kill that snake by sort of hitting it with your stomach? Yeah. I just ripped it apart by jumping into it. So this is not what I thought it was. For some reason, I thought it's Spelunky... It's the official PETA game. For some, re <laughs> for some reason, I thought Spelunky was, um, uh, like, again, some sort of strategy game that I wouldn't be able to master. But no, it looks platformy. Very platformy. Oh, you're going to fall on those spikes. And I'm looking forward to it, frankly. I give up. You got an invisible bull whip? Oh, you didn't fall on the spikes. I, I misjudged you. Uh, I'm sorry. I've played platformers my entire life. I'm not going to fall on the first set of spikes. I'm going to wait to the second set. Her obviously. entire life. Uninterrupted. Yes, Everything. from while, the womb. While cooking, while writing books, attending college. You don't know me. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Can't argue with that. Okay. Did we or did we not play Hearthstone while I was uh, in childbed? In child? Bed? After our child was born in the hospital. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you played Hearthstone when you were a child? How did you do that? Yet no matter what happens, I always wake up at the entrance to the mines. It's like death itself has lost its way down here. So it's like a say, it's like a you die in a computer game. It's, it's like a computer game. Despite the eeriness of these events, I remain focused on the task at hand. Eagerly, I press on pursuing my fame and fortune. Does he not stop to eat? I don't know what how you're gonna. I mean, fortune, sure. I don't know how you get fame down here. And I mean, also, it must be awful in terms of like. I think it's scurvy. I suppose you get. I mean, snakes. I don't know that. Like, I don't think people are following him on Instagram. Or Vitamin D deficiency, you would think too. Ah, I see. Underground all the time. He could have an Insta account. There could be Wi-Fi down here. I mean, there's these ornate, oh, uh, you like whiteboards, all right. instructing us all. Are you there doing bullwhip? Breaking crates! Ah. Breaking crates! I love crates. I, I love every kind of crate. crate. I, I just want to whip them all. all. But you can't, can't break every crate. crate. <laughs> I feel like that's going to be a reoccurring theme if we stream together. Sorry, I was thinking about crates again. <laughs> oh, it's a bat! I really love crates. Oh, I died. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Too busy singing! So far, though, story of my life. We always get the uh, crates thing different. This time, I said, I said, uh, whip, and you said break, and then vice versa. One day, we will impromptu sing the song together and say the same words. Probably the next stream. What did you just How get from I, that chest? Uh, Ninety-eight hundred dollars, apparently. Yeah. This I mine mean, is uh, lucrative. Yeah. It's nice that it's in uh, U.S. dollars as well. The old, the uh, Aztecs are really thoughtful about that. That is a purple bat. It's a glam bat. It's a glam pie bat. It's a gold bat. No, it's what? Oh. I mean, it's purple. What, what did you say? Gold blat? Gold bat? From Pokemon. Oh! I thought you said gold blat, like the surname. <laughs> like, oh, that's Marcus Goldblatt. You know him from Temple. Accounting? <laughs> I went for. I, I clearly. I, mean, I, I immediately. I immediately <laughs> think of agent because Barry Goldblatt's a agent. Well, I said Temple, so. Uh, <laughs> Barry Goldblatt. Okay, is there a mechanic? Mo money, mo money. Is there money. a um? If anyone's played this game, is there some mechanic to this game that makes it, like, special? You know, like Braid had that whole sort of time thing where you kind of when you moved like time stopped and things uh is there something that makes it uh unique or is it just a cute platformer marcus goldblatt and the glampire bats <laughs> oh yeah i feel like they rock hard but also they get a good night's sleep <laughs> it's like rush it's like music <laughs> for math people Uh, for extra points, anyone remember the name of the band in the play and film Proof? It's a math band. And I have it never has seen a either one. Math joke name. I miss Jennifer Jason Lee being in that <sighs> on Broadway. I'm still mad at myself, obviously, since it was like 20 years ago, and I'm still talking about it. I did scenes from it in drama school, and I saw it a bunch. Uh, oh. Who was in the film? Gwyneth Paltrow. Uh, I didn't see the film. I'm gonna have to Google that later. Find out what it is. Hmm. Oh! Oh, and you just slowly descend onto the I was supposed to run over the thingies. Mario style, and I did not. 
<laughs> it's me, a gold uh, blood. I went back very far. I'm kind of grooving to that snake. Don't hit him. He's got a really good, like... He looks like he's feeling the music. Uh, I kind of want to Google Spelunky now and see if the internet is like, um, because of its trans because of its complex moral choices because of its transformative third act, that suddenly everything you know is wrong. Ah, Spelunky. Oh, I threw the bomb too far. Nine out of ten on Steam, ninety-six percent on Metacritic. Your mom's ninety-six percent on Metacritic. My mom's not. Mom's got a 10 on Medicare. <laughs> are we your for momming? Her, are we your, for, your, are for we, inferior gameplay. Are we your momming <laughs> jokes now? Yeah, well, my mother has inferior gameplay. 26 minutes in. Uh, not, not your mama. Not, not much of a reward for the grind. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk about mothers and grinding. <laughs> um. Oh, come on. I don't know. According to this, it's saying gameplay is identical, but different characters, damsels in distress. Well, that's groundbreaking. Um, I don't know. I guess not. Oh, this must be it. Levels are randomly generated. Oh. You are right. It is obviously randomly Thrilling. generated. Ah, so you can play it. It, it, this is actually Hexel's Infinite, but this is um, uh, sp this is spelunking Infinite, presumably, because it's randomly generated, so you can just oh, play so it for check all it out. the time. Oh, nice! I don't know what the point of that was. I still can't get up there. Uh, funny how uh, lots of people were um, chiming in when we we're playing Overcooked and Hexel's. Uh, and <laughs> now y'all are quiet. <laughs> I got a glimpse. How could such a oh, place exist so plant. far underground and what oh, lies beyond? Oh, a platformer with a piranha plant. So Indiana Jones meets Mario. Cave merchants. Cave merchants? What is a cave merchant? Someone who sells caves? Sounds racist. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of even more fabulous science further below, ancient ruins and cities made of gold. The whole city's made of gold. The very idea makes my restless heart beat faster. Yeah, and you need to get a hobby, my man. Restless heart. I thought I was a girl. Feed me Seymour. Give me procedural generated food. You can do it. Uh, be careful. I will just sing. I'll just sing Little Shop of Horrors uh, to amuse myself while you spelunk. You look like you got your eyes closed. The character, not you. Oh, him. It looks like like there's no eyes. There's just lines. It must be hard to kill so many snakes and navigate caves. Oh. I your eyes oh! Does no. the snake just explode into no, puddles I... of blood? <laughs> That's not what I mean. I mean to do. You just throwing those bombs. No, out. I, I. Like truth, like the truth bombs you throw in your fiction. <laughs> Awkward seg, my friend. <laughs> Welcome to Kevin's general store. Kevin lives in a cave. Are the names procedurally <laughs> generated as well? I wonder. Because I feel like they came up with Kevin. That was the best name. By Rope Pile. I don't want to you know what do. that is? That is a cave merchant. That's what that is. That is Kevin, a cave you make, merchant. Kevin, you're making everyone uncomfortable. Uh, why would you set up your shop in that cave? Late stage capitalism. <laughs> um, you didn't like my segue into, into your fiction? <laughs> I'll try better next time. <laughs> Kevin, I mean, there's like gold just sitting around. We need to talk about Kevin. Huh. And why he is in the cave, hawking his goods. I'm stuck. Up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did I unstick myself? You did, just I did. like in real life. Did I life. kill myself? I also Just did. like in real life. If you get stuck, best thing to do is ignite an explosive on top of your head. It's and like Jason from The Good Place. You should probably be unstuck. Throw a Molotov cocktail. <laughs> now we have a different problem. Ah, <laughs> uh, The Good Place. Now, I would play a good place game. A side-scrolling platformer? I mean, yes, I'd play it at least it's once. It's obviously got a complex I, moral choice. But I so. feel like, yeah, I feel like it needs to be uh, like more of a Telltale game. Kind of um, Telltale No More R.I.P. But, you know, that's what it needs to be. More oh, it's a, a girl! RPG. 
I bet she's Hi. in distress. Oh no, she's just. Uh, excuse you. <laughs> sorry. Is that how you treat? Hashtag. I'm is, sorry. Is that how you treat? Sorry. Blonde <laughs> girls. You in finding caves, just whip it in the face. But what? Like, she won't talk to me. <laughs> Look at my rope. Uh, ladies. Rent was low in the cave. Yeah, that makes sense. Ladies, look at my whip. Can you talk to her or, like, help her? No, all you can do is just whip her in the face. Uh, time's up, cat. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, hashtag rope too. Uh. Uh. Proof band. Catherine didn't know the name at first. Plot point. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, that was some nifty difty running. I. Oh! <laughs> that was some poor jumping, though. You were hot footing. I gotta find out the name of that proof band. The internet's not always the greatest with plays, but it's been made into a film, so. Uh oh. <laughs> wow. What did you do this time? It hurt itself in its confusion. <laughs> All right, I've got the Wikipedia article for proof. Let's find out if we can find out the name of the band. Math is a young man's game. Oh, oh excuse me. Mm -mm -mm. I don't think it's going to tell us the name of his terrible... Um, I feel like I have I have band. found $18,000 in this game, nope. and in real life, I'd probably just go home at this point. <laughs> like, <laughs> like call it a, 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 I mean, maybe, a day well worth. Maybe visit a cave virgin first to get a nice cold drink. Wikipedia did not help me. Oh, you checked the Wikipedia first. Fantastic. Um... It will come to me, and I've got the script somewhere. Oh so. no, he's stuck again. Oh well, I guess you'll have to drop an explosive <laughs> device directly onto your cranium. I will. It's the only way. It's the only way. <laughs> <laughs> really, adding insult, adding. Oh my god! Let's try that again. Adding oh, wait, I'm still in the tutorial, even. Oh. No, this is the tutorial. Oh, there is. It says the tutorial. Oh, so good. Uh. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm so awesome at gaming. This game seems hard. It's not hard. It's just tedious. <laughs> I'm not uh, really, I'm not really motivated to find my way through. You know, you if know? if we were a a husband and wife comic duo, the sort that plays uh, <laughs> hotels in Boston on Valentine's Day, that's the point where I'd say, like marriage, am I right? Oh. <sighs> <laughs> Uh, I'm not naming names, but we were I'm in Boston. We were in Boston ah. recently, and there was a married comic duo, uh, and I watched some YouTube videos of them, and uh, it was not. I don't understand why anyone on Valentine's Day would want to go out and see people complaining about how terrible their spouses and how. As far as I can tell, like for people worst. who were born before 1970, marriage like is... that's their main source of entertainment is just like, oh, marriage. Am I right? <laughs> I hate the person I'm just gonna spend my whole life with. All right, says so Cat, you have to run. Right next to me. You have to run across that section. But how? It's not. It's not a running. Oh, that did work. Oh. <laughs> you know that feeling when you get impaled on a spike and then a bat hits you right in the face. I hate that feeling. Remember that time we had a bat in the house? Uh, which time? Because that happened twice. <laughs> <laughs> well, the time. <laughs> The time where it hid by pretending to be part of a painting. Yeah, that was upsetting. <laughs> During the day, just a bat discreetly hanging on a painting. What? I'm a decoration. You got all sorts of funky stuff around the house. Uh, girls do love skulls. Uh, <laughs> uh, grab a skull and then talk to the girl. Yeah, it is. It's like... Oh, girls steal, do like skulls. Steal treasure and then... Show to girl. Oh, is it show to girl? It looks like you're grabbing her from behind. No! Bat! Uh, I love how you start again from the beginning every time. It's uh... Son of a... Bat? <laughs> what do you call a baby bat? Batling? Uh, I don't know. Surely there is a collective... I bet there is. Collective noun. 
Well, it's, I mean, it's not a bird. That's Sky like puppy. A, uh, <laughs> Goth puppy. An air rat. <laughs> I mean, a small one. <laughs> Sky puppy. Uh, I feel like you should work for the bat PR department. Uh, if you started calling them sky puppies, I think they'd have a better rap. All right, bat, bat. Come here, man. There we go. Uh, so they are called pups. Hold me, bat pup. Touch me, bat pup. All right, Lead so me to the pickup skull, pickup girl, dumping pit. <laughs> That whole uh, tutorial there, <laughs> that, that's, that I'm is- I'm not sure. That is a crime. That's what that yeah, is. That uh, is, draw that's 10 to 15. Uh, maybe get out after nine for good behavior. Drop girl in cave. They call pups. You got it right. Bats, baby bats, call pups. I'm always right. <laughs> Except when I try to dump a girl in a <laughs> mine shaft. And then you're you're wrong, ethically, <laughs> logistically, fundamentally wrong. Uh, we are girl in mineshaft. This has been a really great night. Thanks for coming. Wait, so does that mean I should just go get that girl and put her in the mineshaft? I, I I don't know. You're doing that running thing so fast though. No, because you've come this far. All right, you made get it. skull, get girl, drop in mine shaft. Yes? Yeah, but where's the skull? Tomb whomever holds this journal, I'm descending in the caves. I hope the last time. I even great delights to be discovered. A chaste kiss from a random blonde in a red dress, in a cocktail dress. What do you really have in common, though, Yang? Don't wear cocktail dresses if you're going spelunking. That's my advice. I feel like they're more appropriate. Well, there's yeah. merchants down there, so there could be clubs. You're right. That's very true. Uh, so it begins? So it begins. I, I always feel that you should never get an achievement. Yeah, okay, but look, here's my little girl thing again. Oh, oh that was just the picked. tutorial. Oh, that's why you were guy <laughs> with the, the I guy tried that many times in the tutorial. Oh... All I do is win, win, win. I mean, <laughs> the you, opposite of you that. You said I get tired of you winning. Didn't you say that at a press conference? No, the president said oh, that. Oh, yes. <laughs> president of games. <laughs> Don't whip explosives. <laughs> Yang was right. <laughs> you must not whip it. Don't whip it good. It'll blow you up into pieces. Don't whip it. I'm singing so you remember. Don't whip the explosives. So now you're the girl with the green bow in your hair. So it, I'm a tiny innocent girl. Answer me this. Are you going to find a blonde and then throw her into uh, I mean, a cave shaft? Or is uh, this a little more uh, heteronormative and you will find... Uh, you will oh. only be able to find a, a gentleman to throw into a mine shaft. Oh, there's no way they're going to give me a dude to throw in a mine shaft. <laughs> I mean, gaming's come a long way, but not that far. Maybe it'll just be the damsel, the blonde Okay, damsel. but again, I would I like to so. point out that I just found $2,500 in that cave. I'm a little girl with a bow. Call it a good day. Go home good. and sell some Girl Scout cookies. Yeah. Tell stories. Write a book. Write a tell -all. A memoir. If you can talk about how it's based on your real experience in a cave, you can sell that. I just found an $800 emerald. Oprah Book Club of the Month. Is that yeah. a thing? Did I pop culture right? Yes. It's not a thing anymore. Ah, but... Um, I mean, I pop culture from 10 years ago. Yeah. It's... Um, baby steps. Look, there's a giant spider down there. Is that achievement going to just stay there for the rest of the game? What achievement? Oh. It's not on the stream, people, but there's a big achievement that says, So it begins. Is that a spider? Yep. I know how you love spiders. Oh, you know how video games love spiders. Oh, they do. They just can't get enough of them. I love how I'm swimming in the dirt. <laughs> Piece of trivia. We went to Universal Studios, and we went on all the rides, and every single ride had a okay. sequence with a spider, except for the Spider-Man ride. Wow, that is a big spider. 
I'm sorry, you have to be a part of that. This is basically when I go and check on the boiler. <laughs> Pretty much. We live in New England. That's... Murder basement. <laughs> that was just burnt, like, dolls and broken child's furniture. That's just, that's just the truth. That's not a... I think it just comes with any basement. It's not a joke or Any basement in of... New England. Just... This... No, just ours. No, that's not true. Headless statues. I love that we've got the tongue the ostensibly probably sh meant to be Shiva, but it's... Shiva? Well, that looked that didn't look oh, like all yeah. that. It did not. What spider hope? bite! That was the biggest spider I've ever seen. Oh, you get to watch a replay of how you died horribly. Uh, spider pups? Little does little, whatever little, little, a many spiders. pup can. Spins Licks away. your face. Here's and your best eyes. friend. Disappears when you whip it. Look out! Here comes a spider pup. Remember, don't whip the thing with the skull and crossbones. There's a whole song about $1, that. $1,600 ruby. Just go home. We're good. We're done here. It's amazing See? how you can value that, like, on the fly. It's, it's, it's been pretty good. Uh... Kevin. Oh, it's because of Kevin? Kevin's giving you, like, a guide to minerals. Oh. I'm just really great. I was better at the math game. Are baby spiders really spiderlings? You could say anything now, and I would probably believe you. I don't, I don't like so. spiders. Impaled. Is the child alive? Yes. <laughs> don't don't ask that question live on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at the monitor. <laughs> He's asleep. That's good parenting. It's quality parenting. I got him in bed at eight o'clock. Schrodinger's baby. <laughs> it is good parenting. Google is very. Why useful. am I crawling along the floor? I don't know. Uh, can I say that I'm really bored with this game? Uh, excruciating myself. <laughs> Do you have another one for the medley? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I do. Alright, do it. Alright. Uh, so we will still be live, but I'll be ending the stream. Uh, I'll be ending the game. Yeah. Do you, do you want to say goodbye to your green haired girl? Do you want to go say goodbye to Kevin? You've had some time uh, if you together. take the bow off, her head falls off. <laughs> it's a load-bearing... <laughs> Just got booted across It's a load-bearing bow? Yeah. Alright, uh... Well, I just died anyway, okay. so now's a good time. Good time. I hope you guys are all so impressed with my gaming skill. <laughs> uh, Fake gamer girl. <laughs> never. All right. Uh, so we're still live um, while I get the new game going. How are you guys? <laughs> How is everyone? Of course, I have to change the resolution. Stick shift? That's what we're playing? Apparently so. Is that just a driving game apparently <laughs> mrs mouse and so before it's cooking now it's driving a car uh, cool oh uncanny valley animation wait wait wait, wait. um get this going uh game capture let me change this you can write sing and crawl across olmec dungeon floors ah, we're through she really oh, seemed oh, to be oh, swimming oh, oh. in that dirt it's it's a mouse and keyboard, so not that. Good. I'm gonna drive with a mouse oh. and a keyboard. Alright. See if this is working. That guy looks like a serial killer. Uh I don't think about this one either. It wasn't on Steam. We're driving to, to different people's houses and murdering them in ritualistic ways. So it's clearly what's going on with this well, gentleman. Look right at his here. face could be like, I should say at this point as well, uh I I'm just based on the look on his face, I feel like content warning uh for this game. Uh, I think we've moved out of uh, Spelunky, so who knows what could be Is that happening. Ben from the office? <laughs> uh, no, we're playing Stick Shift. Uh, don't Google it and find out what it is, because we want to be surprised. All right, how about Parks it? and Rec. Ben's from Parks and Rec. How about it? We are live. Oh, oh, oh okay. is there audio? Turn, it says audio? turn the sound up. Are you driving or am I driving? Uh, you're driving. No, I don't think there's any music, though. So. Well, not yet, because it says turn the sound up. I know that that's just saying like as in so we can hear hear it. Just play the game. You're way too satisfied with that car starting, my friend. Uh Okay. <laughs> uh <laughs> Okay. Um so Wait, wait, wait. What's going on? 
Okay. Uh, I feel like this game is maybe a little, uh, a little, um, <clears throat> uh, like, streaming up late. Uh, streaming after midnight. Yeah. <laughs> Look uh, at his face. <laughs> I don't know if you want to keep playing this. Uh, <laughs> what is the purpose of this game? Check and my check engine lights on already. What just happened? Oh. You just opened up the program I used to record audio. <laughs> <sighs> Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> it is an open face potato. I think. Uh... <laughs> is this on brand? I'm twelve. <laughs> Is this on brand? Yes. But, but wait. <laughs> but how do we, I know how to shift. Whoa. Oh, I'm sorry. He's way too. Oh, it is. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. No. And I didn't realize. It was on the list. It was oh, on the PC game. From it. it was on the PC game list. Uh, like, I didn't. This isn't some <laughs> weird dark net thing. This was on the PC game list for best 100 best games. Why did you have a seat right over there? Uh, no, I don't know if I want to play this. No, nope. no, nope. it's my nope face. Uh, okay, um, uh, it's it an autoerotic game. Auto, get it? It's a pun. Oh, autoerotic. So is it just that you have well, you, you, your way with a car? You um, you can shift. How? What do you press? I forget. Let me try. Are we playing this for- Oh God! Uh, I don't want it! Let's Make... not- let's not say we do. I need an adult! <laughs> uh, yeah. Sorry, Sokos. Uh, uh, sorry to everyone. Okay, this is- we need to do a P- we need to do a PSA. This house is unclean. Uh, I would like to, um, apologize on behalf of, uh, myself and, um, Catherine here. Uh, PC Gamer, um, is uh, <laughs> gonna uh, pop your clutch. PC Gamer US is at fault uh, for including this game in their list of 100 best <laughs> games. Uh, and uh, me downloading it because it was free. I guess you get what you pay for. In this case, what we're paying for is um, lasting trauma. Uh, a guy whose face is <laughs> moldering in front of us with all of the blood he has spilled <laughs> in his career as a serial killer uh, oh. going straight O face. Well, it was with free. Every shift and so gear. I've been trying to play the ones that are free and cheap as opposed to like. You... Okay, what are we playing now, though? Because we're playing Black Screen, my very favorite ah, game. Ah, Black Screen. Uh, I mean, that was the list of ones I was going to try. I didn't know that we would get through them so quickly, but we have been streaming for like an hour. Uh, do you want to play something else? Sure, what do you got? Uh, well, what do we got? Um, uh, I mean, games. Game. Tetris? I don't think we have Tetris downloaded, unfortunately. We do not have Tetris or, on or the we PC. totally would. We do not have Tetris on the PC. We have it on the, on the Switch, but it's very difficult to stream from that. I have not looked into how to do that. I'm sure the internet knows, but I do not. Um, well, you're going to do Undertale. You want to do Undertale? Yeah, sure. Why not? <sighs> now, I don't like Undertale. I'm literally the only person on the entire internet that doesn't like this game. Uh, humans and monsters, see, you're already biased. The bias is basic, baked into the language. You think war broke out? Maybe because one people were calling the other people monsters. I'm shocked. You know why suddenly everything's like windowed? I guess it's because we're playing games that aren't like full screen. Full screen ones. Wow, 2000, uh, some teen, so, like, this is the last year this could possibly be. There's gotta be a way to get this full screen. It's this kind of professional graphics work that you come to expect <laughs> from our screen. <laughs> uh, for those of you who are confused, and we are, we're now playing Undertale, uh, I guess. Um, I think I don't know if you can play this with the controller or not. Well, it's we can't make that bigger. 
I mean, apparently not. I mean, there must be someone. There must be. There must be someone. <laughs> Is this because we played that stick shift? <laughs> yes. Is that why you now did that like to us? Up late. <laughs> <laughs> Press two or enter. Yeah, I guess it's given. Oh, settings. Settings. Change it. See if we can make it keyboard. Arrows. See if we can make it. Um. Uh. <laughs> the settings just language English. That's it. Uh, is there a graphics okay. thing? Press. Is there a? No, I guess not. All right. Continue. Reset. Bash. Oh yeah, I checked to see if it was working, and I guess my mind oh, was like, "Oh, I was like, this that... game knows our baby's name." Oh no, <laughs> it's not that no, at all. I checked it's to see. That would be that would be pretty great. Uh, I checked to see if it was working, uh, and so I put in a name. Uh, are you gonna stick with Bash? Yeah, why not? Fair enough. Fair enough. We never call him Bash though. That's uh. I do. I call him Bash I Bash on occasion. Bast. Bast. Oh, nice. Ballast. Cool. The far future of two hundred. <sighs> uh, is there sound? Oh. oh yeah. I mean, that's a quality question game. <laughs> I. I, I think, feel seen. I think that's a question for everyone watching. As it's well as super shitty it. and tiny and like 16 pixels. My soul, the very culmination of my being, is a crappy graphic card. Uh, I yep, mean, neat. Undertale wasn't on the list, uh, but it is on the list of the 100 games. It just, I've been putting it off. Hey, Patreon people, you picked Undertale uh, for me to play. I guess, I don't know if this counts or not. I'm here, I think technically it counts. The stick shift. What? Down here, love is stared, to, <laughs> stared through. Automotive technology. Being impaled. <laughs> throwing blondes. Little white throwing, friendliness pellet. Throwing women. So ecstasy. In, throwing women into mine ecstasy. Shops. Ecstasy. Friendliness Little white pellets. friendliness pellet. MDMA. MDMA. Yep. Starts with M. Move around. Get as many as you can. Ah, oh, so it is MDMA. Screw your heart! Yeah, I feel like the flower um, tricked us. Yeah, you can move. Like, well, yeah. Can I? Oh, yeah. no, but only in the... Yeah, I guess. Now I'm a friendly cow bean. Cow bean? It's a cow bean of some kind. Bean? Bean. Oh, bean. I thought you said a cow bean, like magic beans for a cow so old. It's Toriel. Yeah, it is a cow. Yeah, it's the caretaker of the ruin. Ruins? Ruins. 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 Could be ruins. I bet there's ruins involved as well. I think you'll find I'm a poorly drawn heart, not a human. Catacombs. That just makes you think of a honeycomb. I really should get some honeycomb. How do they cram all that ground? That's graham crackers. Golden grams. Is a golden gram different from a gram cracker? It's a cereal. Speaking of crackers, mm, oyster crackers. Wait, is that star like a thing I'm supposed to get? I don't know. Guess not. <laughs> Welcome to your new home in a. But it doesn't even taste like apples. Do you understand that reference? No. Beyond me, Salkos. I just want to check the sound here. Can you hear me eating these oyster crackers? I can. Or is Cat's hair muffling that? Ancient fusions, fusions between diversions and door keys. Well, you know. I'm glad that Jim Morrison wrote some of this. Pearl and Garnet fused together. I'm glad that Jim Morrison wrote some of this game. Ancient diversions between door keys and we dance like naked mad children. Okay, cow lady. Cat's yawning because this game deprives her of oxygen. 
gonna trigger several switches. Do not worry, I've labeled the ones you need to flip. Right. Oh, Apple Jacks, yeah. A is for Apple, J is for Jacks. Uh, it, none of the. Oh. <clears throat> kind of reminds me of the uh, Commodore 64 Labyrinth game I used to play. Yeah, we Love played that, that together, game. remember? When we traveled back in time as no, kids? No, you downloaded it for me. Oh, yes. I did. Uh, I did do that thing. I don't just download autoerotic asphy <laughs> asphyxiation. Obviously you do. Uh, we <laughs> saw that game. <laughs> Down in the underground, monsters may attack you. A land serene, a cow being... I'm just singing from Labyrinth now. Yeah, that's I'm how bored. fights work. <laughs> that's how fights work. Practice talking to the dummy. <laughs> Welcome to my life. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can choose to fight or act or so, item or mercy. I guess. I'm trying to move between, but it's not letting me. I guess you can only fight him then. More of a comment than a question. <laughs> the dummy. Sure. Oh, it's a quick time event. You must have to hit the oh. thing. That's as dummies like to do. You won! You earn zero XP and zero gold. Again, true to life. <laughs> Your victories mean nothing. Your defeats mean everything. Welcome to life. <laughs> Welcome to life. <laughs> Uh, are you writing uh, Sebastian's <laughs> third birthday card early? It's true. <laughs> <laughs> Note to self. Note for Sebastian. Life uh, is meaningless. There is another puzzle in this room. I'm pleased. Who built these places full of puzzles is my question. You know this stream still says that we're playing Overcooked, right? Well, uh, it is an Overcooked stream, so... <laughs> frog it! No, frog you. You must frog it! <clears throat> that song's getting a, a workout tonight. Give it mercy. Give it a compliment. Frog it, you're a nice frog. Ah. <laughs> she looks really. She's like, Hi. you're not a nice frog. It. No, you won. You earned zero XP and zero gold. But did I win if I got zero XP and zero gold? Ah, uh, there's the question. It seems there's something more than. I seems certainly to this place. Uh, have not won a good haircut. Uh, the western room okay. is the eastern room's blueprint. Sometimes the way back is the way forward. It's very labyrinth. Hey, lady. Uh, out of my way, lady. Make out of my a way. better door than a window. Out of the way! Out of the way! Oh. Take my hand for a moment. It smells like cow. Crossing the road. Mm. Now we'll go to the killing grate. Oh, don't <laughs> worry, Timmy. It's not a grate. Wait, other way around. It's not a floor. More of a grate. Parcels seem a little too dangerous for now. Ah. Helicopter cow parent. She won't let you Come explore on. puzzles by yourself. Well, I don't even know you, so... I, I never understood why they say helicopter parents. I know it's the hovering thing, but it sounds like adventurous and dangerous. Helicopters are, you know, they have rotors. Oh, is this supposed to be because, like, the room's infinite? Uh, so, like, in Labyrinth, I have to figure something else out? Yeah. Uh... It just goes on forever and ever. There are any doors or openings or anything. Like that? You just try walking through it. I don't think that's going to be the solution. Again, we just end up reenacting Labyrinth. All those random peasants in the D&D town just walking sacks of XP and gold. It's true. Do not worry. I did not leave you. When there was only one set of footprints... I Listen. was nearly behind the pillar all this time. I was trying to turn it into a thoughtful homily about God. And God is a cow lady. You smell like cud, girl. 
<laughs> Dropping the C-bomb. To test my independence by doing exactly God. what you told me to, without deviation or hesitation. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. It's dangerous to go Testing alone. Testing my here, independence. Don't isn't be independent. A, isn't that a Zelda thing? It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Take this with the sword. Clearly that's Just a... call on my cell phone. Maybe that's a homage. Is that a homage? Oh my. I know how to word pronounce. I read audiobooks and I'm stuff. I'm definitely not going to say where I am though, cow lady. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, it's a... Hello? This is dog. I have! This is dog. This is frog. <laughs> the frog is there. Frog it. Frog it real good! Ooh, Undertale! Under, under, ooh, Undertale! Rib it real good! <laughs> Well, Kyle Lady's here, and we got some advice for you. <laughs> I don't really know the lyrics, but um, <laughs> we have a friend named Melinda. She's a great person. And we were at a dance party, and it turns out I was mouthing off about how no one knows all the words to salt and pepper. I was incorrect. Melinda Boy, knows. Boy, she knew. She knew every single line. The monster doesn't want to fight you. Use some mercy, human. I listened to that already. Uh, I just tried to fight the frog instead. Uh, oh, Wimson. Wimson approach meekly, which means that if I'm nice and console it. Halfway through the first word, the burst of tears runs away. No, it's like being consoled. No, but I did fight. win. That's what's important. Uh, zero XP and zero gold. I feel like it's tricking out. It's, it's subverting our expectations. With its, oh, I hate it when it does that. With its. Graphics. Subverting my expectations just means not good these days. Uh, my expectations were that it would be good, and they were subverted. <laughs> uh, he's reporting meekly again. Let's terrorize him this time. Alright. How would raising your arms and wiggling your fingers terrorize him? <laughs> oh, okay, you're right. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Practical demonstration. Uh, good point. You're right. You're right. I was wrong. It's all right. Do it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, you sow the wind, you reap the whirlwind. Uh -huh. um. <laughs> oh, I keep. I keep falling. Sorry. Oh, my God. It's going so fast. Oh, fuck. Oh, now I'm swearing. Uh. Ring a ding ding. Hello? This is Doriel. Hello, this is Cal. Cinnamon or butterscotch? Do you prefer cinnamon or butterscotch? No. I like butterscotch. Homemade butterscotch is amazing. Butterscotch? Butterscotch. Ah, uh, butterscotch is good. She's, she's acting like she's gonna make me pastries, but she's not. She's probably gonna, um drop you in a vat of whatever it is and watch you slowly suffocate. Girl, you need to back Drown. off. I you need to, like, this tutorial is way too attached. Right? It's, uh, is great. Uh, the habit, haberdashery says, uh, the haberdashery? I, love, I love butterscotch. The homemade butterscotch is amazing. It is great. Listen, is I, feel, I feel like you're trying to bring me around to your orientation and not respecting my choices. Yeah, I've got an allergy. Jeez. Why don't you just put some lemongrass on there? You need to calm down, Toriel. He's saying that because I'm allergic to lemongrass. Well, you, we talked about how allergic to onions, so bring it around. It's a callback. Oh. Wimson, you're going to fight you this time. Do it. Oh, sorry. That was my fault. Oh. Two experience points. Oh, two. so if I hurt them, I do get gold. Yeah, but I bet it changes somehow later on. They're like, why did you hurt them just for that XP and gold? Well, for XP and gold. Yeah, it's a reason. Because everything in my entire life has led me to hurt things for XP and gold. That is... <laughs> and how's that worked out for you in a real world situation? I've got a lot of XP and gold. <laughs> but not in real life. In real life, you nurture things. Do I? I wasn't talking about you specifically. Just... Look, this whole floor says I'm gonna fall through it a whole bunch. Yeah, probably. Uh, some, some great cross hatching. Oh, there immediately. You go. Uh, 
Uh, well, I'm gonna leave you to this. Uh, no, good luck don't leave me. I'm just gonna tile. stop. Uh, I will give up. <laughs> that's why I don't like this game. It's gonna. It's boring. Yeah, that's just why. I this is how far I got work. last time. This is literally how far well, I got. Well, let's wrap it up. We've, we've been streaming for an hour and change. No, I have to hurt this thing. It's a jelly? Is that a jelly? It's supposed to be a slime, but it looks suspiciously like a jelly mold to me. It's probably cinnamon jelly. Is that a thing? Butterscotch jelly is. Did you have airplane jelly here in America? Airplane uh, like, jelly? Yeah. I like airplane jelly, airplane jelly for me. I like it for dinner, I like it for tea. A little each day is a good recipe. No, no, just Australian, just English maybe. Also, now that I think about it, why would you have it for dinner and tea? That's a lot of jelly. When it's just... <sighs> falling through the floor. Uh, Jello, that's right, you call it Jello. Oh yeah, when I look up... Okay, has anyone else noticed that when you look up GIFs, if you scroll down for more than two pages on any kind of GIF Killing app, me you always end up with Bill Cosby, uh, like, eating Jello. Is that just me? Oh. When it's not fun anymore, that's when you need to let it go. Ooh, imitate? Like, why are you copying me? Why are you copying me? The you light, you light immobile with Moe's mouth? You feel like you understand the world a little better? Okay, that's kind of cool. Just laying down. Sexy like wiggle? Why is every game going sexy on us? No, that's not what we it's signed up for. It's jello mold. It's ruminating? Oh. Ugh. Please. Uh, troubling. Flirt, go on. You wiggle your hips. Most of all wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Uh, yeah. Uh. uh. Ah, oh, lime gelatin, my first love. Stereotypical, curvaceously attractive, but no brains. Hey. You already flirted, didn't you? Is that like winning it for you? Or are I you don't just, really you're know. Just following what... your heart. Your heart wants what it wants, and clearly, in your case, what it wants is a monochromatic jello mold. You, you do you. I think we should leave it there where it says you earn zero XP and <laughs> one gold after a jelly mold just... Ah, uh... oh, I just fell yeah. to the no, whole no, thing. I can't watch you. I can't watch you. Oh, no. Yeah. This is this is as far as I get before I I'm like, oh, I'm bored. I can't. I can't. Sorry. So we've had some laughs. We've had yeah. some scares. Uh, maybe next we've... time we'll figure out how to do Tetris we've 99. We've some snakes. Uh, uh... A lot's happened. We're not really the same people we were when we started. Or are we? Well, I'll never be the same person after that driving game. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm going to Google that oh, and find out what that oh, game is after. Oh. <laughs> um, thanks for, for watching uh, and for helping Selkos and others who helped us do things. I uh, mean, in the end, Overcooked was the most fun one. Was it? Yeah! I mean, you are welcome. I mean, I guess it was. I mean, it was more fun than Hexels. But this is a world in which... The Witcher. Exists. I mean, I feel like if it just didn't give you an infinite floor plants, where you're falling through all the time. Zombies exist in this world. There are other. Well, no, of the ones peggle. we play. Oh, the, not just of games yeah. in general. No, yeah. uh, of the one. It was pretty good uh, as they go. Um, uh, yeah. All right. Uh, see you next time uh, when. Woo! <laughs> it's not funny the second time. <laughs> just it is to me. <laughs> but it is funny the third time. The rule is three. Good night, guys. Good night. Bye. Bye.